वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम 1.38 सो स्टेटमेंट इज दैट लिंक बी सी इज सिक्स मिलीमीटर थिक एंड इज मेड ऑफ स्टील विद 450 फिफ्टी मेगा पासकल अल्टीमेट स्ट्रेंथ इन टेंशन वट शुड बी इट्स वेट डब्ल्यू इफ स्ट्रक्चर शोन इज बींग डिजाइन टू सपोर्ट ट्वेंटी किलो न्यूटन लोड विद अ फैक्टर ऑफ सेफ्टी ऑफ थ्री सो यू कैन सी दैट दिस इज द स्ट्रक्चर वेयर अ पी लोड इज अप्लाइड क्लियर एंड दिस इज द लिंक बी सी that is used to support and is made up of steel the width is w and thickness is t clear so this load p is uh, 20 kilo newton load so you have to find the um, width this width w if the factor of safety is 3 so let's start with the solution now you can see that due to this load the force that link bc acts on this member ad ad is will be in this direction and if there is a support so there will be ax and ay in this direction i have already drawn the free bar diagram and uh, that is from one problem 1.37 is mentioned over here so we'll find the load that is acted upon by this link bc uh, on this member ad so you can see we will find this force by using moment equation that sum of all moment about point a is equal to 0 and taking the counter clockwise moment as positive so about this point a one moment will be fbc into perpendicular distance is 480 and it is producing counter clockwise moment so it will be positive the second moment will be due to this p and perpendicular distance is this 600 and this is producing clockwise so i will write 480 into fbc minus 600 into p is equal to 0 so from here fbc will be equal to 600 p divided by 480 now we have been given as p is 20 kilo newton so 600 into 20 multiplied by 10 raised to power 3 divided by 480 so when you calculate this fbc fbc will be equal to 25 into 10 raised to power 3 newton now this is the force in this member bc and we are designing this width and this factor of safety is given as 3 so we will design this width based on factor of safety so we have ultimate strength that is given as a uh, uh, 450 mega pascal 450 mega pascal we have been given and factor of safety is equal to 3 so we know that factor of safety is equal to f ultimate in term of force divided by f force working force which is fbc so from here you will get f ultimate because the area will be calculated based on the maximum ultimate force so fbc is equal to uh, uh, sorry f ultimate will be equal to fbc multiply by factor of safety so fbc is 25 into 10 raised to power 3 and factor of safety is 3 so we will get maximum force ultimate force is 75 into 10 to power 3 newton now we know that ultimate strength is equal to our stress is equal to f ultimate divided by the area so we have this we have this we do not have a so a will be equal to f u f ultimate over sigma ultimate so f ultimate is 75 into 10 to the power 3 and sigma ultimate is 450 into 10 to the power 6 so when you calculate this area this area comes out to be 166.67 into 10 to the power minus 6 square meter now it this member bc is rectangular cross section so this width is this width is w and this is the thickness t so for that we know that area of rectangular rectangular area is equal to 
thickness into width thickness into width so this thickness into width will be equal to 166.67 into 10 to the power minus 6 so we are interested to find w so 166.67 into 10 to the power minus 6 divided by t so 166.67 into 10 to the power minus 6 and thickness is given as 6 millimeter that is 6 millimeter so in term of meter it will be equal to 0 0.006 so when you calculate you will get w will be equal to 27.8 into 10 to the power minus 3 meter or in millimeter this width is 27.88 millimeter so this is the width of this rectangular cross section this rectangular cross section having a factor of safety of 3 and this was all about problem 1.38 i hope you have enjoyed this video kindly subscribe my channel and keep watching the videos and if you have any question you can ask me in comment section thank you for watching